The next speaker is World Evangelical Alliance. You have the floor. Madam President, the World Evangelical Alliance draws attention to the well-being of minorities in nations at every Human Rights Council session, which we consider to be the litmus test for SDG 16. We would like to highlight two country situations. First, in Malaysia. It has been two years since Pastor Raymond Ko was abducted. The Malaysian government has failed to bring justice to the organized and well-trained group that kidnapped Pastor Ko, as well as shed light on the three other disappearances. We urge the government of Malaysia to ensure that the well-being and safety of all religious workers and the freedom to carry out their duties free from intimidation or threat. We also call on Prime Minister Dr. Mahathir Mohamed to order a new police investigation into the abduction of Pastor Ko and other three disappearances. Second, in Algeria, authorities have pursued their campaign of intimidation and harassment against Christians. Nine Protestant churches have been shut down by the police over the last year and a half, of which six still remain closed and many others have been threatened of closure. We call on the Algerian authorities to reopen all closed churches and allow freedom of religion for all. We thank you, Madam Vice President.